Hey, I'd like to start making a new series of uh, videos um, about things that have helped me in my life. Now, it could be a thing, it could be something I did, it could be uh, technology, it could be a person, and uh, perhaps I'm not going to organize it as a new series, perhaps I'll just uh, integrate it into my existing one, the uh, Guide to a Good Life. We'll see. Um, but I wanted to start talking about what has helped me in my life, and perhaps it'll help you as well. So the first thing I want to talk about is uh, a typing class. This is uh, perhaps considered something banal these days, <clears throat> something trite, something not really that important. I know all of you who are perhaps in high school or college or younger in your 20s are all on your phones going like this with your thumbs on those virtual keyboards but um, keyboards the actual keyboards that go clickety clack they're still around as you can probably see and it is incredibly useful to know how to touch type touch typing means that you can type fast without looking at the keyboard and so you'll simply sit there and think about what you're typing or perhaps look at a text that you're referring to and continue typing and it's incredibly incredibly useful as a skill um, it's certainly a lot better than doing the, the old hunt and peck where you're going like this right <laughs> having to look at the keyboard doing it with one finger it's very slow and unproductive and um, touch typing is much much faster than uh, than um, using your thumbs on those virtual keyboards as well even with predictive text and i know there's a speech to text uh, software these days and um, i use it sometimes it works pretty great on my phone for example when i want to dictate a quick message uh, to send to someone but it's not useful for normal conversation it's uh, it's still slow and it'll still mess up big time when you're talking in a relaxed sort of manner you have to really enunciate the words with that so it's still got a ways to go uh, in order to recognize what we're talking about and, and transcribe it properly into text and punctuation used, uh, yeah but I'm not I'm not here to talk about speech-to-text technology I'm here to talk about a typing class which is it has helped me tremendously um, if I remember correctly, I was in high school and it was um, either my junior or senior year and I was on this um, AP and honors course track where I, I was taking those more difficult courses, I guess you might call them, um, so that I could get into a good college. and have a good job and so on and so forth, you know, the, uh, the things that we tell ourselves when we take these courses. Um, and it worked out for me, by the way, so don't, uh, don't think that I did something wrong there, but um, there are many paths in life, and that's one of them, right? Don't, uh, don't paint yourself into a corner by telling yourself that that's the only way to get ahead in life, because uh, it isn't. But I was on this AP and honors uh, course track in, in high school and I had an empty slot in my schedule that I needed to fill with something. And um, I didn't want to take a shop class. And, <laughs> and I saw the typing course and I said, well, what the heck, let me, let me try and, and take that and see how that's going to work out. And it was uh, a tremendous experience that I appreciated as soon as I began to get the gist of it back then. And it was something that I've appreciated throughout my life ever since. Because in this world of ours where so much of our work and so much of our lives is digital, being able to communicate digitally in a fast and productive way to get your thoughts down on a, on a document or in a message to somebody and get on with your day is a tremendous asset in your life. 
and it helped me right in high school because I'd have summer jobs and instead of working as a bag boy at the supermarket which I did by the way I worked as a bag boy at a supermarket and I pushed in the carts and I scrubbed bathrooms and did the windows and did all that I was now able to take uh, summer jobs where I clerked in offices where I was um, typing up documents doing photocopying office work basic office work and it was a jump up in pay and it was certainly a jump up in in uh, work conditions and after college after college after high school I got these summer jobs as well where now not only did I know how to do the typing but I also had experience as an office clerk so I was able to get better jobs and better paying jobs as well during these uh, these summers and it helped me in college tremendously when I would type up all my papers um, because I was an English major in college and I loved doing research going into the library and uh, digging through the books uh, and taking them back to my little um, cubicle in the library you know tucked away in some corner somewhere with my little stack of books dusty books musty old books with that old book smell which is something you probably don't have these days either and uh, going through them and writing my papers that was fun that was a lot of fun and after college it helped me in my masters when I had to type up those ridiculously long papers for my masters and of course it helped me in my career afterwards uh, I worked in IT for a number of years and uh, being able to type things fast even when coding was a huge huge deal so I would encourage you so much um, to go out there and take a typing course. Maybe high schools still offer this kind of thing. Maybe you can take it uh, in, during a night course, uh, in a night school somewhere. Uh, I know there are plenty of apps that can teach you how to type these days. I'm not sure how good they are. I think it helps to have that competitive atmosphere that you get in the classroom where you're competing with the other students about which one can type faster and the teacher starts to stopwatch and goes okay now start to type now and you all go click 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 and you try to bust each other and then he goes hey stop now see how many words you type let's see how many mistakes you have so you kind of need that experience uh, I guess and I'm glad I had it um, it was really good that's not to say that a shop class isn't a good thing either because I found myself many a time uh, during uh, my life needing to know how to do construction work like a little masonry, a little mortar work, a little spackle work, a little electrical work, a little pipe work is going to come in incredibly useful it's going to come in incredibly useful <laughs> great phrasing from an English major by the way that's uh, it's going to be very useful to you um, later in life. Incredibly useful. It's, it's, it's good to know how to do a lot of things in life. Um, because in, you, know, you never know when they're going to be very useful. But right now, I would just like to go out. I'd like to encourage you to go out there and take a typing course. Because it's going to pay dividends throughout your life. Okay. Thanks for watching. See you next time.